Hi guys, this is Pete Stockley from Innomnia, and I'm going to tell you about PhotoSync, a very powerful photo transfer tool for the iOS. So the main screen of PhotoSync will show all the images from your camera roll, and there are four buttons in each of the corners for us to use. The first button our top left allows us to view the different albums we have on our phone. If you only have the camera roll, then you're fine, but if you've organized all your photos, then this is a useful tool. The button at the bottom left is our view button, and this means when we tap the photos, we're actually going to view the images, just like in the camera roll, for example, instead of selecting them to then transfer them later on. At the bottom right, we have our settings button, and this allows us to connect to any of the cloud systems we want to use, such as Google Drive, Facebook, or Dropbox. Uh, within these options, we can even choose the destination folder within Dropbox, for example, and whether we want to create subdirectories. We can also choose the picture quality and the video quality when we're transferring, depending on whether it's Wi-Fi or 3G. At the top right, we have our transfer button, and this is where all the magic happens. First, you select the photos that you want to transfer, or you can just choose the select all option. And then you're going to be asked to choose where you want to send these photos. So you have all the options here, all the, the computer, another iPhone, iPod or iPad, um, as well as all the cloud accounts. When transferring photos to a computer that has PhotoSync installed on that computer, this is the screen that you'll see. And the files will be transferred to a folder as defined on that computer. If you don't have PhotoSync installed on your computer, this is the screen you'll see and you can then use a web browser to access the photos. To transfer photos between iOS devices, make sure PhotoSync is installed on each of them and then start the transfer. To transfer photos to a cloud system, simply choose the specific cloud system you want to transfer to, such as Dropbox.